Hello, welcome to Cars in Cologne. I'm Mel. And today I have four fresh fragrances from Parfums de Marley. Give me a second, let the intro run, and I'll see you on the other side. Hey everybody, welcome back. Well, again, today I have four fresh fragrances from Parfums de Marley that I think will go great for the summertime. One second, please. Oh, peach. First up, we have Greenly. Greenly, I remember I went to uh, Lenox Mall down here in the Atlanta area and I was I had watched reviews of it I had heard about it and I really wanted to get my nose on it because I like the the scent of green apple and this has a heavy green apple opening that I think that you would really enjoy the main accords are woody citrus fruity a bit powdery and it goes down into it like a mossy fresh uh, amber base so this is one that I, I think for the summertime because of the freshness of it it will go great with whatever you decide to wear for the summertime it, uh, it's it's a really uh, light aromatic fragrance everybody would enjoy uh, top notes of green apple calabrian bergamot mandarin orange in the middle you get pedigrain, cashmere, cedar, pomeros, and violet and it dries down into a base of oak moss and amber wood so you go from like a um, a fruity kind of um, fruity kind of apple, green apple opening down into a ambery base that is really pleasant it's masculine believe it or not everything's unisex let's put that out there Everything is unisex, so you can wear whatever you want to wear. But if you're masculine, you're you, you know you're a man, you you know you walk in your manhood, and you like masculine fragrances. This is one I think will be great for the summer. Next up, okay, this is another favorite of mine. It's Sedley by Parfums de Marley, a citrus aromatic, fresh, spicy. Uh, again, it's a little green, and it it. it uh, dries down into a musky lavender um, centrail siage. Well, musky lavender base. So, how, how, how it smells when you initially spray it is going to transition um, over time into a, a, a musky kind of lavender base. But it's all good. This is a great fragrance. Sedley is a good one for the summer. I think uh, any anybody would enjoy it. You know. Okay, Sedley was made in back in 2019. So it's one of their newer iterations that they put out. It's by Olivier Cresp, who's a great perfumer, known throughout the world for his knowledge. So and he did a wonderful job on Sedley. Uh, you get a citrusy top note, you know, lemon, mint, bergamot, uh, grapefruit, mandarin orange, the middle goes into what I was speaking of earlier that lavender and you get rosemary olibanum geranium um, on the base you get ambroxan sandalwood cashmere and vetiver cedar and patchouli so it has a really fresh citrusy opening and it, it transitions down into a uh, woody base really great fragrance um, it, and what I like about Parfums de Marley's um, offerings is the fact that they last. So you're not just you're not spending, you know, three four hundred dollars on a fragrance to only last a few hours. A few sprays in the morning will get you through your day. When I first started getting into the house of Parfums de Marley and really appreciating what they had to offer. I bought a box of samples. I think it was around somewhere between 200 and 250 ish dollars. I got six, no, I got eight 
10 mil samples and one of them was Percival. Now Percival opens up with an amber uh, fragrance. It's, it's kind of woody, it's, it's very aromatic, musky. Again, it has lavender in it and it dries down to like a fresh, powdery, citrusy type of smell. Now, it came out in 2018. The person who created it or the nose behind it was Hamid Moretti Kashani. You have lavender, mandarin orange, bergamot, geranium, so you have a citrusy, slightly flowery opening. The mids are hidden violet, coriander, jasmine, cinnamon, and it, it dries down into an ambroxan, amberwood, balsam fir, musky, and clear wood type of fragrance. So you get, you, you're starting with these um, fruity, citrusy opening, and it's drying down into like a cedary type of base, a, a really woodsy type of base that really smells fantastic. And when I'm, again, when I'm done with this and I'm halfway through it, I'm gonna uh, add the bottle to the collection back there. Last up, we have one of my favorites. And it took a minute to grow on me, to be quite honest, because the opening, to my nose, it was, it was a bit astringent. And I was new coming in, uh, but this is Galloway. This is Galloway. Uh, citrusy, musky, uh, fresh and spicy. It has white florals. You have iris, and then it has like these anim animalic, uh, sweet uh, amber type of uh, uh, accords that come in and um, engulf uh, the, the fragrance. Now, Galloway was launched back in 2014. It has citrus and pepper top notes, and that's what was kind of throwing me off. That pepper is pungent. <laughs> Not in a bad way, because it catches your attention, you know, but it is, it, it is uh, there. You do smell it. Uh, mid notes, orange blossom and iris, and then it dries down into a, a musky amber uh, base. Just like the other fragrances, they have that, they start citrusy and they end on a woody note. Now Ga Galloway is a unisex fragrance. Again, Parfum de Marley, you know, they don't discriminate. You know, they don't care who buys it as long as you buy it. But it was actually named after a Scottish horse. It contains, again, citrus, pepper, iris, and orange blossom as their main notes. It's a great fragrance, one that I think is wonderful for the summer. This is Galloway by Parfums de Marley. That's it for fresh fragrances from the house of Parfums de Marley that I think will go great for the summer. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you thought about my opinion of the house of Parfums de Marley and I'll catch you on the next one. Take care of yourselves. Enjoy your life. You only get one. God bless.